and welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. Today I slept in and I just took a shower so my hair is still wet. Um, I haven't really done anything to it. I'm kind of going for like the grungy chic look today. But I've just been cleaning my room. Um, I thought I'd show you guys what my bed actually looks like with the pillows on it because I never have them on. And this blanket is just really soft for the winter time so I just put it on. Look, my dog digs with his paws and ruin the blanket. But this blanket's like really old and it's like super fuzzy on this side. I don't know why I don't have this side showing. Whatever. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is what my bed looks like with the pillows um, done on it. I really love this bedspread and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna use it at my new house too because I don't wanna get a new bedspread. Oh, I changed the color settings on my camera so it auto adjusts. So now I can see that the, this is the true color of my bedspread, not the color of it like a second ago. <laughs> and I also have this candle burning in my room. It's not Christmassy at all, but I really like the scent of it. It's called Surfs Up by um, Yankee Candle. And I just wanted my room to smell uh, fresh, so I decided to burn that one. And then I'm going to be going out soon, so once I blow out the candle I like to leave the door closed to my room so that the smell just like stays in here and like freshens up everything that's in my room I don't know it just sm smells really good when you open the door again but if you're gonna do that please remember to blow out the candle before you leave the house so I just thought I'd show you guys a little outfit of the day just before I leave so I'm gonna go run some errands now oh the phone is ringing Okay, now that the phone stopped ringing, I can show you guys my outfit of the day. So as I was saying, I didn't do anything to my hair after I took a shower. That was weird. I think that's the answering machine. I have no idea. <laughs> Anyways, um, sorry, my hair is in my eye. Um, yeah, so I didn't do anything to my hair after I took a shower. Like, it's actually still, like, damp. I can feel it. It's, like, fresh out of a towel, you know, when your hair just, like, naturally parts after you take it out of a towel? Yeah, that's what my hair did today. <laughs> no product, no nothing in it. I don't know, I just kind of liked the way it looked. It's kind of like a grungy, chic hair look, and it kind of goes with the rest of my outfit, so I'm just gonna show you that. Um, I decided to wear this green shirt. It's from um, Costa Blanca. It's just plain, and it's long sleeves, just like really loose fitting. And then I wore it with this flannel shirt. You guys have seen this before. It's from Aritzia. And my flannel shirt has some green in it. So I thought I'd pull upon that and wear the green shirt underneath to like go with it. I really love this flannel a lot. It has a hood. Not that you can really see because I'm horrible at showing you guys what I'm wearing. Um, yeah, it has a hood. So it's like a boyfriend fit. And it's just really like, like it, it looks like a boy's shirt. And I just love it. I love the look of that. And then I'm wearing light wash skinny jeans. Um, I would probably wear Converse if I was wearing if I was wearing this in a country that was warm, but you know it's colder outside in Canada, so I'm wearing my combat boots. And then as usual, I'm wearing my Michael Kors silver wash that I love to death. Honestly, it just goes with everything. I love silver, and I'm wearing this like really loose um, like rosary bracelet. It's really cute, and my aunt Ashley bought it for me, and I was talking to her last night, so I thought I'd wear it. It just reminds me of her and makes me really happy. Okay, so this is really crazy. I was pulling into this plaza because I'm going to run some errands and I see my friend Catherine. I'm pretty sure she's going to work because she works here and I just found her. She's in this car next to me and I'm trying to park with one hand. <laughs> We're going to get out of the car and freak out now. Oh my god! Hey! I'm vlogging by the way. <laughs> Did you catch that on camera? Yeah! Like no, I vlogged it afterwards. <gasps> oh my god! I just like locked my car. So I left everything in there. I'm waiting, and I'm like, <laughs> that's Rachel. Oh my god, that's Rachel. Like, what are the odds that I like looked over to you? It was really weird. That was so funny. <laughs> I'm like, please look, please look. <laughs> I'm like, I'm going to Target over there, but I'm like, oh, she's going to work. <laughs> so to recap what just happened, because I didn't fully explain it, I was like really excited in the moment. Um, I was coming into this plaza, and I was driving in, and there was like a stop sign that I had to wait at. And for some reason I looked over and there I see my friend Catherine in the car next to me but she was like in the left turning lane and I was in this like going straight so we both went at the same time and 
I knew because she was turning like where she was going because she works over there so I like <laughs> went straight and then like turned around and went all the way back and like parked right next to her I found her car and it was so nice because I texted her last night because I haven't talked to her in like so long and then I ran into her today so that was pretty sweet I was so excited we like sat and talked for like 10 minutes before she had to go to work um I'm pretty upset because I just went to the bank and I went through the drive through because it's really cold and I needed like an envelope because I needed to like deposit something into the bank and they didn't have any envelopes at the drive through so that sucked I had to just um like take out some cash anyways and they gave me an old $20 bill that sucks the new ones look like this but this is a five they're like plasticky which is pretty cool but anyways I'm sitting in the parking lot at Target I'm just gonna go in I needed to get a couple things for myself and then I just called my mom letting her know that I'm like here and asked her if she needed anything and she like gives me this whole list of things she needs she's crazy like come yourself <laughs> but no it's okay I don't mind running errands for her I recently got this curling iron and I really like it so I recommend you get it too I'm in the aisle of teas and hot chocolates and this one looks really good look it's a variety of Rolo Coffee Crisp and After 8 Hot Chocolate. Mmm, sounds delicious. $2.99, I think I might get it. This is what I was really looking for. I wanted to get a flavored coffee, but I needed coffee beans. All the good ones are like K-Cups and Tassimo. But I'm gonna see what they have because I drink coffee more than I drink hot chocolate, so I think that'll be better for me. Seriously, having the hardest time of my life. This one smells so good. Or French vanilla or coconut. This one smells really good. I was just gonna get French vanilla, but I saw this and I think it's gonna be good. I think I'm gonna get cinnamon. Oh my god, I'm kind of freaking out. Oreo brownie, and I love both. All right, I just got home from Target. Look who's here to greet me. Look, every time I turn on the camera, I swear he runs away. But like five seconds ago, he was jumping on my leg like that. Anyway. <laughs> My mom's here too. All right, mom, this is what I got from Target. Should I do your stuff or my stuff first? Okay, your stuff. I bought you lots of chocolate. There's the receipt. Okay, first, she asked for chocolate because she's doing some, the, this like Christmas thing. What exactly are you doing? Uh, advent uh, trees. She's making advent trees with these chocolates? I don't really know what she's doing. Anyways, so I got these Hershey Kisses. Um, these ones are milk chocolate with a white cream inside. I don't know. Oh yeah, these are supposed to be really Yeah, good. I bought these are so good. The peppermint chocolate. Uh cinnamon. Oh, that's what I bought that for myself. It's so good. Oh, oh so I bought this flavored coffee. It's cinnamon vanilla. Smell it though. It smells so good. Smell that circle there. Mm -hmm. Doesn't yeah. it smell good? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make some right now. Okay, you're ruining the haul. You gotta do one by one. <laughs> they usually have the peppermint like candy cane um Hershey Kisses, but they didn't have any. They only had these flavors, so I got them. Got one of each. So yeah, these ones are the white milk chocolate with white cream. These ones are the caramel ones. The caramel ones are so good. These ones are the cookies and cream. Why did it, why should I have gotten more of these? Uh, don't they have like the white uh, milk chocolate, the white chocolate mix? But these are all they had. Okay. I don't know, this is, yeah, these are the cookies and cream. And then these ones are the almonds inside. I've never seen that before. Seems okay. I just got one of each, so it's a variety, because you said you're doing like an advent tree, right? Mm -hmm. Do you know how many are in each bucket? Or? Yeah, I did some math. <laughs> I pulled out my calculator on my phone. So it says that, the math I did, it says 200 grams in a pack. And then on the back here, it says that 42 grams is nine pieces. So I divided 200 by 42, by 42. Yeah. And then I multiplied that by 9, and it said, um, Approximate, yeah. and then I multiplied, oh wait, and then I multiplied it by 4, 4 packs, it said 168, and then yeah. plus this, this, I did the same kind of math, like 200 grams, and then it okay. says 12 grams per one, and it says okay, there's like 16 in here. Okay, yeah, so that's what I got for you. Then, for me, and for my viewers, um, I got myself some white Christmas lights for my room. They were on sale. They were like, it says ten dollars, but I think they were like six dollars. Those indoor? Yeah, and they're white, like white, um, white wire. Cause normally Christmas lights have like a green wire, right? Mm -hmm. Um, 
I was trying to see if they were battery operated, but it didn't say anything about that. I'm pretty sure it's just like you plug them in. If not, I think we have batteries. This should be okay. Then, I bought myself, oh, I bought this nail polish. Isn't this pretty? It's like a maroon red color. I have no idea how to pronounce this name. Mal Malgara Wine. Anyways, it's really pretty. So I got that. It wasn't on sale or anything, but I was looking for a nice dark nail polish because my nails chipped. Look at that huge chip. And it really bothers me. I need to have like nice nails to write exams or else it just gives me anxiety. I don't know why, but it just does. So I bought that because I wanted to put that on my nails. It's more Christmas and festive. Then I got this little um, Christmas ribbon thing. It was in the dollar section. I got two of them. One is going to be part of a DIY that I'm doing after my exams are over. So after December 12th, probably go up like before the 14th because I want to get it up right away so you guys can actually do it. But it's going to be part of a DIY. So I got one for that and then I got another one. Where is it? And this one is to like wrap presents and stuff. I thought it would be really cute. Because there's probably not very much in there. It says two yards, but that's not that much. Then I got... My cousin is coming over tonight, so I got her a puzzle. It's these lions. It's 100 pieces. It says ages five and up. How old is she? Five or six? I think she's five, but she's like super smart, so it doesn't matter. Um, it's a 100 piece puzzle. That should keep us really busy for a long time. Then, the surprise, so I was watching a YouTube video and somebody mentioned that it was in their Nove November favorites that they liked inked, inked in pink um, color tattoo by Maybelline. So I decided that I wanted to try it because I think it'll be really pretty for the holidays. And I got two because one is for you. So one of you guys will be lucky enough to have one. Um, it's it's going to be a giveaway in the comments of this video, so I want you guys to comment. Mom, what should they comment? My mom's cooking dinner, if you can hear that. You should comment. Oh, comment your favorite Christmas song, because I want to make a playlist so that I can listen to it in my car. And then I bought a little stocking to put it in, and I'll fill it with chocolates and send it out to you guys. So I will announce the winner in tomorrow's, uh, tomorrow's vlog, so comment. Actually, I won't do it in tomorrow's vlog. I'll give you a couple days to do it, just so that everyone can see this vlog. But, um, yeah, comment below with your favorite Christmas song, and I will be sending one of you guys these, uh, this Maybelline color tattoo, because I've never tried it, and we can both try it together. So, yeah, leave me a comment, and I'll be giving that away. Anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's vlog. I'm really excited to put up my Christmas lights, but I'm going to hold off until tomorrow, so that will be part of tomorrow's Vlogmas. So I hope you guys all enjoyed. Don't forget to comment below to be part of my Christmas giveaway. And, oh, the only way you guys can enter is if you... See, Google Plus kind of messed things up in the comments, so... Or not messed it up, but it made it a little bit more difficult, because I can't reply to all your comments. So I don't know if messaging you will... I will have this... My mom is making so much noise, and I'm trying to vlog here. Um, I don't know if it'll be, if I will have difficulty messaging the winner, um, after I choose that, but I'm just gonna say go ahead and leave a comment below. I will pick a winner in the next few days and announce that in a future Vlogmas in a couple days. So, I hope you guys all enjoyed, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!